Good morning. It's Thursday, June 23rd, 2022. I'm Russell, and this is Rocky Road Devotions, a few minutes of help for your journey today. Our devotion today is entitled, Without Vision, Nations Crumble, and our scripture is Proverbs chapter 29. Where there is no vision, the people perish, but he that keepeth the law, happy is he. The reason the apostles were all willing to die for Christ, and most of them were martyred, is that they had a clear vision of the cross. They knew God had been crucified on Calvary, but he was alive again. The vision of a Lord who not only ruled life but death as well gave them the power to live and die as conquerors. It was a clear vision of living in freedom that caused a ragtag bunch of slaves to follow a former murderer named Moses out into the desert. It was a clear vision of God's holiness that caused Isaiah to fall on his knees and cry out, Woe to me, I am a man of unclean lips, and my eyes have seen the King, the Lord, the Almighty. Isaiah chapter 6. It was a clear vision of an irresistible call of God that caused a young shepherd boy named David to stand against Goliath. And it was a clear vision of the need of grace in the life of each one of us that caused Jesus to set himself towards Jerusalem, to submit to the emotional pain of Gethsemane, the evil purposes of a sham trial, and the excruciating penalty of judgment for all our sins on that old rugged cross. My friends, if you can get one clear vision of what your life is to stand for, your days will never be the same. In Christian circles, we call that finding God's will. I've been told so many times by sincere, seeking people, I'm certain God wants me to do something. I just wish I could know what His will is. Beloved, you're no different than anyone else who's ever wanted to know God's will. The fact is, God himself wants you to know it. Often, we're so less willing to do God's will than he is willing to share it with us so that we aren't in a position to hear his will if he shouted it in our ears. There are conditions to knowing God's will, but you can hear and understand God's direction for your life if you want to, and it will open your eyes for you today. If knowing God's will for your life is the most important responsibility He's given you, isn't it the clearest mandate you need to seek that will above all else until He reveals it to you? You chew on that as you hit the rocky road. Have a blessed day.